beautiful people. Today we are going to go on a journey but into the wonderful world of Valley. What's this game about? I honestly do not remember. So for all I know, we, be, we could be going to the Valley of Shadows. Or Valley of Death, I do not know. Mirv, uh... I guess male. Life's seed is said to contain an incredible earth shattering power. While ri mostly written off as myths, some archaeologists are already still determined to track down the other survivor. So I guess we're. This isn't a Valley of Shadows then, I guess? Because if it weren't. Or if it were. Then there will probably wouldn't be any life seeds, but why would a seed need that much power to be? It's just a seed, it's well I guess Is what is that the what type of tree is that the tree that the seed's supposed to grow? The loading? I don't know. Uh I guess the seeds are technically that have earth shattering quote unquote power. I'll be back once this loads up, unless it froze on me. Uh, yeah, I'll be right back. Here we go. Looks like I missed you. I just wanted to wish you luck before you headed out. I still can't believe you're doing this. I mean, hunting down the, what was it, the life seed? You gotta admit that sounds crazy. I mean, even if this mythological thing that can shatter worlds or whatever <laughs> actually exists, what are the chances of you tracking down this ancient relic in the middle of the Rocky Mountains? Listen. I know you want to prove the thing exists. I, I get that. It's an adventure. Hell, it's your career, but can't you do something normal like the rest of us and just backpack Europe or something? Spend a month in Thailand? Never. But hey, if by some miracle you find this thing and become the most famous archaeologist of all time, beers are on me. I'll even trade in your tinfoil hat for a whip and fedora. I just really hope all those canoeing lessons pay off. I need to turn on the volume. Isle Studios proudly presents very loud game. I need pulse. Pulse. I can't hear myself. Forgot to. There we go. Thought this was. I thought this would have been loud enough. Quite enough. Okay, I'll be right back once this gets... I think your canoe might be a little broken. Yeah, this game... It is... Can I... Don't? I guess not yet. Okay. Can I run, though? Okay, I can run, at least. Um, ruins, cave, drawing... Where are they? Okay. Where the heck am I? I'm pretty sure you're in a cave. And I'm pretty sure that's his water outside the rocks. I don't know. Hold. Why do I? I don't know why I need to run. But I can still. This is a. Uh, um. This game is really pretty, ain't it? Thought there was something behind me for a second. I said that rock. I thought it was something else. Just the grass in the way. What? I don't like it when a game tells me I'm able to run. Which means there's something I need to run away from. That is pretty. Yeah, why do I need to run? Why is there a bunch of glowy ducks? Is this the real tree life seed thing? Uh. Ow. Ow. Those are bright. Why do they gotta be so bright? 
can give you a headache, can't they? Uh, oh. Okay, woo! Hello, little buddy. Oh, what are you getting? Okay. Why do you all have to flash for a while? Should have. Wish I'd taken a screenshot of it. What is this place? How hard did I hit my head? Oh, that's a good question. But you're not gonna question what these little green buddies are, are you? I would be questioning what these are. Ooh, are you gonna stand still enough for me to? Oh, okay, so close. Uh, stand still for me, will you? I need to take a picture of you. Yes, sir, camera show. Okay. Well, hopefully, I looked at you long enough. But yeah, this game, I don't know what it's set about. Besides, for I guess something to do with nature. An old army truck. So crashed you ages ago. Can I open you? What is this? Leaf gear? Looks like a mechanical suit. Hello. Um, I don't trust it. I can only say I don't trust it. Kangaroo man! Fighting the war in Europe. What are you doing? Okay. So, kangaroo. As as a I'm sorry, I can get cheated. <laughs> We should have that power. I will. So this is cool, at least you, huh? Ooh, I can already tell we're already moving a lot faster, aren't we? Just a bit. Oh, jeez. Let's see what those old reels. Oh. Virginia King, Audio Journal, June fourth, nineteen forty-one. Shortly after the outbreak of war in Europe, I was enlisted by the army to study the history of this valley. The mysterious forest sprites seem to be the last living remnants of the long-lost culture that once lived here. A large number of them seem to inhabit the northeast sector of the valley, just past the ruins where the life seed, rumored to possess an earth-shattering power, was found. I mean, I wanted to find that. That's as good a place as any to study them. So at least we know it actually exists, I suppose. Look at my little clauses. Ow. So we can run quickly. Run down slopes, okay. So I guess we gotta run down the slope there. Okay. So let's go face. Whee! Ow. Oh, hit your head. So yeah, I guess we're just gonna keep on going, going, going. As quick as a cheetah. As fast as a squirrel. Celtic music going on in the background. I don't know if y'all can hear that. I'm gonna pause. Okay, how do I do that? Shoot towards. Ooh, so we can get life back to the trees, it looks like? It's lovely. It's very lovely. 
hope we can get some energy back somehow. I just realized. Uh, you're already dead, aren't you? Oh no. I wish I. <laughs> I want to give that t deer some knife back. Uh, yes. Okay, I'll be right back. Everybody, once I find something important. Which was this right here? Touch an orb to absorb its energy. Ooh, this is me like it. Oh, ooh, I'll be I'll be right back. Alright, we are back at the deer. I just wanted to uh bring the deer back to life. There you go, buddy, buddy, buddy. Are you okay? Live long and uh live long wherever you wanna run off to. I don't know. But yeah, I guess I'll be back now. Be back in a little bit. But yeah, this game is really, really pretty, ain't it? But yeah, it feels like this game is all about having a need for speed. Did I just waste an energy? Let me go back and get some of that energy real quick. And put it towards... Not this tree, because the tree's still alive apparently. So yeah. Feels like this game's all about the need for speed sometimes. And restoring life. Collect enough acorns to gain access through a certain doorway. Huh. What is it talking about? What ancient doorways? What acorns? What ancient doorways is it talking about? Life can be taken from nearby. Less robot, huh? I don't want to take no laugh. Oh, but I can though, I guess, to get some energy. If I were desperate enough. But I'm not desperate enough. I don't want to bother the creatures, you know what I mean? We want to make sure everything's nice and healthy. Right? Hopefully. Ooh, this is really, really. Oh, I guess that's the. Uh huh. Find a way through the ancient ruins. And there's that uh, life. Seems like fireflies react to energy. Okay. Whatever you say, boss. Upgrade, which is nice, but yeah, I can't believe how pretty this game is. And a lot of uh, mystery there is to this game, in there. I'll be back, I guess, once I uh, get done exploring the ruins of this here cave. Or ancient ruins. The or military not. is helping to explore all these ruins through the soldiers piloting leaf suits. They call these soldiers Pathfinders since they can trek through terrain normally inaccessible to someone like me. Every guy back home is going to want to go joyriding in a leaf suit. But until the military's project comes to a close, we're cut off from any contact outside the valley. I guess the world will have to wait just a bit longer. Now this is said to be used across ancient pyramids. Okay. Get their hands on these rides. I wonder. Can I get over there? I can, okay, I didn't expect to get over, be able to get over here. I just wanted to explore. Okay, okay, I could have... Okay. I'll be back again unless for some reason besides pop up the, uh... stuff now. 
Alrighty, yo. Ready to see something really fun? I've just learned something I can do. You see the little shiny summary stuff down there? We can just jump right on through and break the floor. Oh, okay. I guess I should probably pay to go over here. It's time to go. Silence, pilot in leaf suit. We purposely through through. Bad English, apparently, because you don't need to speak it. Are known as Pathfinders, their ability to manipulate life with running at speeds up to 110 kilometers per hour makes them a deadly addition to the battlefield. That sounds deadly and dangerous, because I don't care who you are, ability to take away life, let alone give back life. Ooh, the journey begins. I don't care who you are. That's a dangerous thing that no man should ever have, man, woman, or child. Or anything in between. What are these glowing orbs that everyone is making a fuss over? TV. They're absolutely beautiful. They seem to grow randomly throughout the valley. I know nothing about them other than that they are indigenous to this valley and that the army is using their energy for their war project. That's, That's about as much as they'll tell me. <sighs> it's such a shame. It is. I wish they would just let them be. But I suppose it's the whole reason we're here to begin with. If I could jump, this is really, really sad though. We could just have let this ruins and these masked people. Okay, hold on a bit, quick. I gotta be right back. I gotta change the sensitivity. Okay, I think I fixed it. This is probably a little bit more quicker than me. I say it's probably because I don't have to get a feel for it. VA, more energy upgrades. I wonder if we can find an upgrade for anything else. Yeah, from what I can tell, this game is really, really pretty and has a whole lot going for it. I might just make a... If I can remember how to jump, I'm I promise I know how to play game. But yes. This game don't look right into the sun. Serious valley. I know I probably said that wrong. Hey look, it's our little friends from the beginning, the little green blobby dudes. Leah. They just do come running right up to you, don't they? Brave little dudes, aren't they? I wonder what would predate on them. Little buddies. Hello. Take a picture of them for later. Make use of that as my screen save. My favorite screen now. FMG. Don't just jump. Don't, 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 don't. No, no, no. Okay. Valley health. Valley health. Uh, uh, uh. So if we die, I don't know. The least quantum death functionality allows you to return life after die. Uh, but I guess it affects everything around us to some degree. Uh, that's not good. I guess now we gotta kill up some plants? Or else the valley will no longer be sustainable. Well, but life must be traded for life. The more you die, the more valley will die around you until it's fully done. Without enough life, so our, I guess the valley is our personal uh, life source, I guess? So we take care of it, and it'll take care of us. I feel. Uh, I don't know. But I think I'm understanding that right. Could be wrong. Uh, I don't know. I'm not that smart sometimes. I'm not gonna lie. That's just an educated guess, one would say. Worshipped the giant tree here almost as a deity. Great huh. lengths were taken to construct obelisks around this tree, which the ancients used to help grow it. I've begun to use the term Titan Tree to designate this species. According to my interpretations, once every thousand years the Titan Tree will produce the mythological and famed life seed, said to possess the power to shatter the world into fragments. No wonder the military is so interested in this place. Well, I gotta find the 
Well, this, so that tree produces a life seed. Uh, I guess it was a tree we were supposed to be noticing. I do not know. See, I gotta find some obelisks, so, uh... I'll be back once I find them, wherever they may be. Okay, I just realized I think it might be the um, towers with the big blue light. That could just be a very uh, educated guess, but yeah, I'll be back once I get to them. Oops, Oops I forgot to hit this. Are so lively. I've done my best to study their behaviors, but. Without a zoologist on site, I'm mostly coming up dry. They're completely harmless, so the army tends to ignore them as they go about their research. I wonder if the world would clamor to have these Danes as pets. I'm sure my mother could use one. Better than all those feral cats in her backyard anyways. I have a question for you. Would you all want the little green buddies as pets? Because I don't know if we should, we as humans should have them. Yeah, back to the uh, exploration of trying to find where the heck I'm going. Because I don't know where I'm going. Okay, so apparently I found a thing I didn't know I was supposed to do. But once I did it, I made a red tree for them. So yay. One big tree down, many more to go. Now it's time to get on the road again. On the way down, on the line again. And I'll be right on back after to the next one. Oops, I forgot to hit the to BC. Strangely though, the Olmec civilization was much younger and located no less than 5,000 kilometers away from here. Yeah, this is what it was I found. And then I just did that. And there goes an explosion of energy into a big tree. I'll be back to the third one. a bringer of death on a global scale, splintering the earth into fragments. Such end time scenarios are common across mythologies, from the apocalypse to Ragnarok. However, it's unusual for the event to surround a particular object, especially one acquired by mortals. Okay, with this, I think I should end this. Okay, I think I see why it's called the uh, Titan Tree. Though I guess Redwood might have worked here too. But Titan Tree is much more majestic for this type of uh, tree. I don't care what anyone says, these little buddies are, are adorable. Adorable and cute. They're cute. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, those things are adorable. And with doing all three of the obelisk. I shall end it here. And uh, talk at you guys later. Peace and have a good day.